Hi, in this video, we'll take a look at how you can uh, customize the control center and how you can use them. Now the control center uh, basically give you access to, um, quick access to some of the functions. It's like a shortcut center where you can uh, quickly use uh, useful features such as um, a torch. You can tap on a torch, turn on a torch. Uh, you can quickly access a calculator or timer or an alarm. You can also quickly change the brightness of your screen or change the volume. You can also screen mirror of your, your phone to another compatible device. You can quickly turn on uh, do not disturb or turn it off or lock the screen rotations. Now to customize the control centers, you can add in more items or remove the items or you can uh, rearrange uh, any of these items around down here. Now to do so, let's go back to your home screen first by swiping up at the bottom. Then tap on the settings icon. From here, from the settings screen, what you want to do is to uh, tap on Control Center and then tap on Customize Controls. Now in here is um, the top section is the um, all the items that has already been included uh, in the Control um, Center. So these are the items down here from this part down. These are all the icons or the items that already have been added. Uh, they have been added by default. Now you can also remove them if you don't want them and you can add in a new one. Uh, they are just there by default and they are assumed you know, that are the most uh, common use um, shortcuts. So to add them in, so add more items, just tap on a plus icon um, down here. You can add them all of them in. Uh, in fact, you can add all of them in. And then once you're happy, you can drag it down and have a look. You can see uh, more items has been added. Now some of this um, uh, shortcuts you can tap and hold to that so you can see if I tap I can turn on the touch but I can also tap and hold to that and this will allow me to um, control how much brightness uh, I can use on my touch and then also other apps as well uh, some apps you can tap and hold some you can't so it's depending on the app and then you got the camera so I can tap on the camera and then if I long press on it I can uh, choose I have more options to choose I can choose uh, take selfies record video take portrait or um, if I um, use this uh, disability shortcuts or ability uh, accessibility shortcuts sorry and then I can uh, tap on one of these uh, functions here so that is the control center uh, adding in items. So if you want to rearrange them, you can tap on the side here. So tap on the side and then you can just drag it up and down. And once you are happy with the position, you can let go. So let's say the flashlight is first, time is second. If you drag it down, you can see flashlight is first, the time is second and calculator is third. So if I want to place the calculator to the top or the first position, I just drag it up and you can see now the calculator is in the first position. And in here, you can see you can also control the music. Now the top part here, you cannot rearrange, they have um, fixed at that locations but you can control the music you got the music control up here you can uh, quickly access um, airplane mode uh, mobile data you can tap and hold on to that to open up this um, this uh, square box here and it will give you more options and then here you can uh, turn on cellular data on or off you can turn on Bluetooth on or off uh, Wi-Fi airdrops and then you got personal hotspot. Now the personal hotspot doesn't appear, so you need to tap on that to expand uh, the box out, and it will give you more options to choose personal hotspot. Now another things, so that is all there. Another thing that you might want to take notice is this access within apps uh, switch. This basically this switch here uh, will uh, prevent other apps from access to the control center. So you can see if I go into this and uh, not app, if I swipe down, I cannot access the control center. So in order for me to allow other apps to uh, access the control centers, you need to turn this option on. And there it is. And that's it. So that's how you can uh, uh, customize the control center and how you can add or remove items and how you can uh, make full use of it by uh, long press on certain items to give you more options. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.